To meet ever-changing business needs, organizations need to invest time and budget to scale up their IT infrastructure, such as hardware, software, and services. However, with on-premises IT infrastructure, the scaling process can be slow, and organizations are frequently unable to achieve optimal utilization of the IT infrastructure. Cloud computing is a paradigm shift that provides computing over the Internet. A cloud computing service consists of highly optimized virtual data centers that provide various software, hardware, and information resources for use when needed. Organizations can simply connect to the cloud and use the available resources on a pay-per-use basis. This helps companies avoid capital expenditure on additional on-premises infrastructure resources and instantly scale up or scale down according to business requirements. You can deploy a cloud computing service by using three different models, a private cloud, a public cloud, or a hybrid cloud. A private cloud functions solely for one organization, on a private network, and is highly secure. A public cloud is owned by the cloud service provider and offers the highest level of efficiency in shared resources. A hybrid cloud is a combination of private and public deployment models. In a hybrid cloud, Specific resources are run or used in a public cloud, and others are run or used on-premises in a private cloud. This provides increased efficiency. Cloud computing consists of the following service models. Infrastructure as a Service, ES. Platform as a Service, PaaS. And Software as a Service, SaaS. By using the ES model, organizations get infrastructure components such as computing power and storage capacity. Here, the organization has control over the entire IT infrastructure, including the hosting environment and their applications. However, the organization needs to allocate additional staff to maintain and manage the infrastructure and the application. Microsoft has proposed remote desktops and virtual machines to Microsoft Windows Azure as an ES offering. The PaaS model provides organizations with a platform or a runtime environment to create and deploy applications. Here, the organization is only responsible for the development, maintenance, and management of the applications. Microsoft provides the Windows Azure platform as a PaaS offering. The SaaS model provides organizations with ready-to-use applications that use a combination of cloud-based compute and storage services. Microsoft provides various online services, such as Microsoft Business Productivity Online Suite, BPOS, and Microsoft Dynamics CRM Online as a SaaS offering. To understand how cloud computing can help an organization extend its IT capabilities, consider Wide World Importers, a company that manufactures beauty products. Occasionally, the research department has to store and process a large amount of data. Consequently, the company is looking for a cost-effective compute and storage solution. Additionally, Wide World Importers has a group of scientists situated at different geographical locations. The geographical barrier affects research, requiring a better collaboration solution. In addition, the company is planning to develop a cost-effective data mining application to collect visitor data during its week-long worldwide annual beauty pageant. Cloud computing provides wide world importers with an efficient and cost-effective solution to their problems. Wide world importers can subscribe for additional compute and storage services offered by Windows Azure on a pay-per-use basis to move all of its statistical data analysis and storage to Windows Azure. By doing so, they can invest more on research. Wide world importers can use BPOS, Microsoft Live Meeting, and Microsoft SharePoint Online for efficient collaboration. For design, development, and testing of the data mining application, the company can use the Windows Azure platform to focus on software evaluation and reduce the time and cost required for preparation of the development and testing environment.